Session. This looks like a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus my mind. Hey, BD-1. I'm Cal. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. Hold on. Y you know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, hold on! Did you just slice that? Thanks. the vault seer mentioned whoever i'm supposed to find must be waiting there that's a really big bug mm. any ideas gotta get across this gap somehow the zip line whoa how'd you know that would work wait you didn't Careful over there. That doesn't look safe. Just like back at the scrapyard. Hold on, I'm coming. Hey, that was pretty brave. You okay? Wait, I can help you with that. Will you let me? Oh, <laughs> okay. Hmm. Well, your scomp is busted, but this should help you get moving for now. Hmm. Okay, let's try that. Yeah, that's where I was headed too. Okay, well, first we gotta figure out a way out of this place. Vines look like they lead somewhere. Hope they're sturdy. Droid. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Here, hop on board. Hey, a chest. Think the Jedi would mind if we grab supplies? Where are you going? Did you find something, BD1? That's where we need to go. I can feel it.
all right, BD? Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Eno Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault, is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. You know, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hey. You want to meet some, uh, friends of mine? Should be a lot quicker than the way in. Pass the test. So you knew about BD-1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! No! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil state out of Batoli weed fabric? Not really. Oh. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of force sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. How come you're no longer a Jedi? 
I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. We're in. Dathomir Zepho, it's your choice. <laughs>